Hey everyone, we have moved outside here because we want our chance to say goodbye to Penguin and to Jill and Jack Sabo here. We want to talk with them uh, as well about everything. And we kind of thought, not only because it's cold outside, but because it's such an emotional day, you guys should probably have some Kleenex. <laughs> So we brought Kleenex out. We brought the Kleenex out. And as we were talking before, we really want to show our appreciation to the Sable family because of the work that they've done, the selflessness to put in all of this care for Penguin. So let me come on out. <laughs> yeah, and Penguin, I love his bow tie. He's all dressed up today. Special occasion, have to be dressed up. Has to be dressed up. You know, we want to ask you actually a viewer question that came in. It was a viewer named Zach, and he was asking about epilepsy. And would Penguin, could he be trained to help detect a seizure coming on for someone who has epilepsy? There are dogs out there who can absolutely detect seizures and epilepsy. However, Canine Companions does not train those types of dogs. It's a very different type of training than what we do. However, if there was a dog who had that aptitude and wasn't cut out to be a service dog, Canine Companions could partner with another group that would do that and pass the dog over to them. But it's very unlikely that that would be Penguin's track. You know, I feel very connected to, to you all and, and to Penguin because when Penguin was born, it was right around the time that I was having Rocco. In fact, I was on maternity leave for his first <laughs> visit here. But it has been amazing to watch him grow. What is, and I know you've talked so much about this, but what has it been like for you to be part of this journey, the, the selflessness that you all have given to raising him? I mean, it's amazing. Penguin is our third dog. We've had Simon and Coral before, but he is really different. And to be here with Team PTL and to see all of the awareness and exposure that Pittsburgh has been able to provide with Penguin through PTL, it's, it's been great. And we want to ask you about this trivia night that you guys have devised because all of Pittsburgh, all of Western Pennsylvania has learned about Penguin. And so this coming Tuesday on Penguin's Facebook page, you have something special planned, right? Tell us about it. Yes, yeah, so we're going to be doing a trivia night, 25 questions about Penguin and some general questions about CCI, but mostly centered on Penguin and things that you would know if you followed him on PTL or followed him on his Facebook page. And we have some prizes for the winners, some um, Penguin stuff, some PTL stuff, and um, there's going to be some special guest appearances, asking questions from all of you, and we're just we're just so excited to share this with everybody, and one last big party to celebrate Penguin. Well, I know this is your third dog, but uh, the, is this the first time you've spent the first leg of the journey on TV? Yes, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> this is a unique experience. What is next Friday going to be like? You've been there before. You know how this works. It's going to be indescribable. You know, we get to the center. It's a new center. They just built it last year. So this will be our first time seeing it. But, you know, when you get to the center and you see not only the dogs who are matriculating, but also the dogs who are graduating, who are going with their forever person, you know, it's bittersweet because we're seeing, you know, Penguin turn in and go off to his next adventure. But at the same time, you know, his tail is wagging. He's with his brothers and sisters. So it's definitely something to watch. Jill and Jack, uh, we, we can't tell you how much this all means to us because we've learned along this journey and we've become so attached to Penguin and uh, we're going to have to wrap things up right now. But Penguin, best of luck to you. Thank you. We know you're going to do well. I'm going to give him one more last kiss. One last kiss. And right. Give him one last kiss, Heather. One last kiss for Penguin. Oh, yeah. We're going to miss you, buddy. Oh, and he's wagging his 